Uh, this is based on something that's happening locally around Sheffield, uh, all over the place. Uh, they're, they're shutting pubs and clubs, and then for some reason, pubs and clubs are becoming uh, nursing homes. I don't know why. This one's called The Club. It's early in the night, and the concert room bar is shuttered, so I walk through to the lounge. After a day of carving the names of the dead into one million year old marble, monumental mason Billy Middleton sits a solitary figure at the end of the bar. He likes five or six double gins before he starts drinking. He says it settles his stomach. Hey up, Billy, I say. It's looking a bit black or your mother's. He just nods. He'll be more communicative after he's had the gin. Behind the bar is the steward, Mick Carson. Mick doesn't drink while he's working, but there is an ever-present cup of tea on the bar. I buy a pint of magnet and let another night take its comforting and familiar course. The turn battles against the early indifference of the crowd, with Andy on Hammond and Badger on drums. Tables filled with glasses are quickly cleared by an army of kids. The offal bar shifts trays of tripe and trotters. A crystal silence falls for the bingo, broken only by the euphoria of a shout. The turn returns to rapturous applause. They'll keep clapping until they've drunk up. It's the end of the night and time for Mick to have a drink. He quickly knocks back a shot of Wood's 100% rum. When he's finished packing up and everyone's gone home, he'll have half a packet of Woodbines and a couple of pints of Wardsers. But first, there's a job to do. Time, gentlemen, please, he says. Then, you don't have to go home, but you can't stop here. And finally, We've had your money, now bugger off. And the happy amnesiacs drift out and weave their way back to rent and rates and bosses and bills. The world turns and my hair turns grey. The turns and tombola are long since gone and the club is an old people's home. Today's youth gets its bread and circuses on street corners or without leaving the home. Widescreen MTV is a better home for angels than some bleached baritone and his backing tapes. They're bored with beer and they have other lives to live. And in one of those ironies that show God has a sense of humour, some of the regulars are now residents of the club. Billy Middleton's mum died ten years ago, so he sold his tombstone business and bought shares in the home. Mick Carson is no longer as sharp as he once was, and his caring family found it fitting to find him sanctuary in the place he had once worked. And in their spiritless rooms, Billy and Mick come to the end of another day. Without anyone to tell him, Billy Middleton wonders if it's a bit black over his mother's. And although there is no one to send home, Mick Carson calls time. Thank you.